Okay, so for this video, I'm going to be explaining my dynamically layered weapon inside Unreal 5 using Metasounds. But first, I'm going to go through the Reaper project. This is where I initially came up with the idea for the gun equip sounds and the gun shot sounds. As you can see, they are layered throughout with color coding for organizational purposes. And in the next section, I'm just going to let the Reaper project play so you can hear why I initially came up with. Inside the Unreal 5 project, I began by creating two separate meta sounds, one for when the gun is equipped and one for when the gun is shot. Inside the gun equip meta sound, I have two separate wave players, one containing the weapon buzz and the other containing the weapon sparks. Preceding those are two random float notes, which in effect generate a random pitch when played. Both these wave players are set to loop continuously and they are both connected to a stereo mixer, which have the volume controls connected to an input, which we will come to later. Inside the gunshot meta sounds, all of the separate layers are within a random wave asset array. Those are then connected to the wave players. So when played, it will randomly select a version of that layer. All of the layers are then connected to a stereo mixer to control the volumes for all of them. Before that, there are random time nodes effectively creating a delay time, and those are random every time the thing is played. So the click layer is always going to be first, but then the layers below will be a bit sooner, might be a bit later, but there'll always be a slight delay. There is also a random pitch generated at the same time. The way I have it set up to play inside the game level is by an input action. So for the gun equip, I have it set up so that when I press the number five on the keyboard, it will trigger the audio component gun equip to play. Then when I press the number six, it will trigger the other audio component gun shot. However, I also have dynamic volume control depending on what layer is played. So when you press the number five, it will add the audio component of the gun equip layer. But when I press six, it first triggers the set float parameter of the gun equip main, effectively the master volume of that meta sound. It first sets that to 0.1, effectively muting it before adding the audio component of the gun shot. After that, there is a slight delay before it then sets the float parameter of the gun equip main back to what it was before. So effectively ducking the equip noise when the gun is being shot. I also have it set up so that when you release number five, effectively de-equipping the weapon, it sets the volume of that meta sound down to zero effectively, before then executing the trigger parameter of stop gun equip. Effect. So it turns it down, then stops it. After going through all of those steps, I will now just play what I come up with as a final result inside the game level. Thank you. 